UWAP Group, specialists in materials flow for production systems. We are present in Sweden, Germany, Italy, Switzerland, France, Spain, the United Kingdom, and the USA. We ensure that all our work is orientated day by day towards attaining our maximum involvement with your company. We would like to invite you to join us on a visual journey through the plant of the Ford Motor Company in Almusafas, Valencia. During this visit you will get a step-by-step -step guide on how the production process of the camshaft for the Sigma engine is developed. At UWAB we have an unquestionable ethos of innovation. We design, produce and install systems developed exactly to meet your needs. This is the loading zone where the raw parts are taken from the containers by a robot and deposited onto pallets, whose base is made from polythene, a material that possesses magnificent qualities for use in productive processes. Rigid and highly resistant to wear and tear, shock and abrasion. The pallet can be constructed from different materials depending on the existing need, aluminium, steel, iron and others. The chain on which the pallet is conveyed is made from fireproof material, is highly resistant and can work at speeds ranging from 2 to 180 meters per minute. Once the loading operation has been completed, the pallets are directed towards the first operation where a planing process will be carried out. As you can see, the system is designed on the basis of a continuous flow of materials with the object of achieving a just-in-time production. To attain this, we have the standard components that allow the parts to be directed to the right place at all times. Let's learn about the steps that the part undergoes along the more than 130 meters of production line from the moment at which the raw part arrives at the loading zone to the end of its transformation process in the unloading and inspection area. As we will see, the UWAB production line guarantees the highest level of synchronization and speed. Synchronization, speed. The study of these needs, the specific characteristics relating to the production flow and its volume, the product type and other conditions, determines how each step of the productive process should be developed. Once the planing process has been completed, the pallets are directed towards the next operation, where the different processes of drilling, threading and milling will be carried out. Observe a motor station closely. Throughout the line there are different traction groups linked together that are distributed on the basis of a preliminary study in which different parameters are assessed. Weight of the part, pallet weight, number of operations that are performed, cycle times and many other variables. A large amount of data with the objective of achieving an optimum distribution and, as a result, the prolongation of its useful life and the consequential reduction in the cost of maintaining the system. As you will have been able to appreciate, the physical shape of the pallet has now changed. In the production line there are three different types of pallet, without mechanical coating, with coating and pallets destined for the washing area which have holes that ensure perfect drainage. The production line is completely automated from start to finish. Its design fully optimizes the use of space, ensuring that the minimum possible amount of space is occupied. Optimization of space.
The parts are always traveling in an orderly manner. The FIFO order is maintained at all times, that is, the first part to enter is the first to leave. FIFO order. The turning operations are carried out and the parts are directed towards the rectification area. The system knows which processes have already been performed, identifying the parts in the areas where this need exists. This allows an automatic improvement in their quality, knowing instantaneously if a process is not performing as planned. Trackability Although the production flow is adjusted according to the specific characteristics of the plant, the flow can be modified to suit the needs at any time. Our lines are characterized by their high flexibility. Therefore, they allow sections and parts to be changed immediately without significant modifications in their architecture. We seek to implement changes in a short amount of time, with minimum stoppages in the production process and a minimum investment. Having completed the inspection operations, we can look at a standard UWAB elevator, which was designed with common but clearly differentiated objectives. Due to the physical configuration of the line in the shape of a U, we must short-circuit both sides of the application. On the other hand, upon joining both areas together, we must not create an architectural barrier that will impede the passage of vehicles or people. This is all solved with the UWAB elevator. The system is very easy to manage. It offers the maximum features without losing sight of simplicity in its use. Simplicity The transformation process continues. The planing, rectification of the cams and various super finishing operations are affected. Following these steps, we observe the incorporation of a new type of pallet that will be used until the end of the process. The measuring stations prior to unloading ensure the optimum condition of the parts, following rigorous quality controls that are implemented in all processes carried out in Ford's plants. The UWAB systems pay attention to the smallest details during the entire production process, including those relating to the human factor, ensuring the most suitable working conditions for the operators. Optimization of personnel, pleasant working conditions. The systems are designed to optimize the full use of the floor space and to develop solutions that ensure the operator's accessibility to all work areas. Accessibility. This line was installed in 1994 with the most modern control systems available. We achieved maximum quality at a low investment cost and with high performance levels. Now in 2001, due to new production requirements, the Ford company has decided to modify the structure of this line. We have planned the extension of a specific area of the production line and the modification of various parts. However, the main part of the line as a whole is clearly well planned because the installation in 1994 is completely modern and suited to today's needs. Cases like this allow us to guarantee our maximum involvement with your company. UWAB Group